lovely day, absolutely glorious weather here as we welcome you to a football match of considerable significance, great consequence in this part of the world. They've been talking about this one for a while and they have rolled up to it in fantastic numbers. You should have seen the roads outside the ground in the hour or two leading up to it. It has been bumper to bumper, the traffic has been extraordinary, but the level of expectation is also very, very high. And uh, these supporters who uh, were queuing around the block for their tickets as soon as we knew the date of the fixture, well, now they can't wait for it to begin. And begin it will any second now. It is a venue, this, which simply adds to the spectacle of the game it stages. One of the most impressive arenas in this part of the world. The action has already started. How do you, Jim, see Baker with tries and shots? The invitation was received with such a clever run, and he had that defence in, in utter confusion. Juventus took the early advantage. Hardly anything between the sides, and the score is 1 0. And Bike was well to read it and intercepts. Tries lifting it over. Well positioned to make that interception. Here it comes. Great leap! Oh, just needed a better contact. Well, plenty of moving targets to pick out in the box. Obviously increases the chances of the ball being met like that by someone. He's made sure that that won't get through. Gerard. Tings it out wide, cuts it out. has got good distance on that. Well played, he saw that coming. Van Dijk. And it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Maldini. Maldini. Gorgeous control there. Pirlo. With a delicate ball. Gerrard. Tested the keeper. Well, what can I say? Truly wonderful goalkeeping. No messing about, just bludgeoned away. Maltini. And he heaves it forward. Delivers across. Massive leap! Oh, he couldn't get the direction he needed. No, that was a slick move, and there were several options in the box to, uh, to pick out. Should have come up with something better there. Ah, oh, that just required a bit more oomph to reach its target. He's got it, and he's got time. And 
That will be the last act of the first half. So there you have it, a close sport half of football that still had its moments and ultimately produced just one goal. Back on the first 45 minutes. Well, when you look at the goal in quality, the gap should be greater, but there are higher gears to be found, so maybe we'll see that reflected. Juventus head for the dressing room in possession of a 1-0 lead. Start of the second half. Juventus carrying a one-goal lead. James McCarthy. McCarthy looking to run onto it. Cut out in the nick of time. Cristiano Ronaldo. And it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Played out to the right. Been up for a throw in. And he's got the ball glued to his feet. Messi's cross. Let's be leave it clear. And here's Messi. Whipped in. And he just whacks it away. And it's played forward. Rafael Baran. Out to the left it goes. Out for a throw. Well, this lead is beginning to look a little delicate. I'd rather see them show the ambition and adventure to go further ahead. But it seems as if they settle for a, a riskier approach now to defend this. Maldini plays it over to the other flank. Pirlo. And here's Messi. Messi, that looks a good ball. Towering header! Oh, the keeper's done ever so well. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. Oh, terrible pass. Decent looking ball. Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. Gerard. Gerard. Oh, shooting chance! In it goes! Two ahead, late in the day, game over, surely. And that is about as cool as they come. He picked his spot expertly. Well, I think two keepers would have had a hard time keeping that one out, never mind one. There was real venom in the strike and, and clear composure from the placement. Celtic are uh, making a change now. Well, you have to feel a little for the player being taken off here. I think he's been made the scapegoat after that, but I guess something had to be done. I suppose it did need a little change. Juventus get themselves a two-goal cushion. This is quite a run, and he's not done yet. And it's McCarthy out to the right.
one more twist. Perfect placement, the one place the keeper couldn't reach. Now that's what I call finishing, right in the corner. He knew instinctively who was where and didn't need to waste any time weighing things up. That's a cracking goal. Celtic. And that is it, the referee has seen it up. Juventus winners by the odd goal. Ooh, could have gone either way, but a win is a win. Any reflections on what you've seen, Tim? Yeah, we knew there was a sizable gap in the quality of both squads, and, and the story was told in predictable fashion. Well, we've reached the end of our coverage for today. Many thanks to Jim Beglin alongside me, and we'll both see you next time. Yeah!